Hi, I want to start this one off with him. Welcome back. Ah, oh, hello, Kinsman. To what will be chapter... Staying not chapter, part 8 start. of my, uh, my walkthrough and gameplay series for Skyrim. There's one requirement if you're gonna watch this video. You gotta sit back, throw your feet up, and relax. Some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. I don't right. claim to be the... Hmm, blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your needs. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is, um, I can make some iron in, uh... Not iron, jeez. Armor in her uh, in her forge. Um, I just want to try out the blacksmithing properly, and uh, I just need to buy some. Uh, hey, check that out! It's a pretty badass looking bow. I'm not gonna buy it, but it's still pretty. I'm gonna acknowledge that it's pretty. Uh, I need some. I need five of these, five of the iron ingots, and Don't that's all she wrote. Now let's go make me some fancy armor. All right, so that's what I'm gonna make. So that's what I'm gonna, yeah, that's what I'm wearing. So, let's go ahead and make this up. Let's see what else we got going on here. Really, you know, it's not a bad selection considering I have absolutely no experience as being a blacksmith. But, uh... Okay. I like the hammer. Alright. So, we're just gonna give, uh... It's gonna put on a little fashion show for you guys. Check this out. Oh yeah, look at that. Check that out. That's uh that's much sexier armor than what I had on. Alright, let me just give me a moment now, I'm just gonna check out what quests I've got going on at the moment. I'm um I got some miscellaneous or as I like to say miscellaneous. Um I'm gonna stick with the main storyline for now, just for a bit. I um <laughs> the last couple of videos I did was just for the Golden Claw side quest line, which don't get me wrong, was pretty damn good. I enjoyed it, but um, I want to get to the point in the game where I can start using. Actually, I want to get to the point in the game where dragons are coming at me. I want to do that, and I want to learn how to do a uh, my dragon speak, shout, voice, um, thing. Hello. No, <laughs> Lolly Gagan. What an excellent word. Life's hard oh, we got some options here. But that bard is the worst. That Mikhail bard Mikhail Isaac. is begging for a dagger up against his throat the way he goes on about me. I heard him boasting at the Bannered Mare saying he'll conquer me as a true Nord conquers any harsh beast. Huh. He's got a way with words, that one. If you want to try, go right ahead. I don't think anything will get through that thick skull of his, though. My greatsword might. You've got no idea. Half the men in White Run have proposed to me. Some were even single. They'll never understand. No amount of flowers or honeyed words are going to change my mind. Right now, all that matters is my daughter Mila. No man's going to get between me and my little girl. I can respect that. Remember, um, just what she was saying there about how, you know, day. some of the guys were even, even single. If there's one kind of person I cannot respect, it's someone who uh, who cheats on their partner. I just I can't do it. They're the lowest of the low, in my opinion. How are you? What is it? Hey, gruff. Only if I can help it. <laughs> hey, it's a village Damn drunk. If I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the Bannered Mare, there's this bottle of Argonian ale, the good stuff. Get it for me. They won't even know it's gone. Fuck Come that! I'm not funding or fueling your habit. <laughs> not funding. <laughs> that looked that was actually the option. More to talk about. Yeah, I'm not gonna give you a gold coin. Get out of my way, you sure, drunken well, rummy. Do you get to the cloud district very often. Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. Jeez, what a I dick. With my mother, so I know huh? It's fun. Did you know there are some fruits that actually grow better in the cold weather? I think she was just following me. You'd be surprised how much work it is selling things at a stall. It's not all standing around and chatting. Yeah, right, she's one of the few people in the city that I've liked so far who haven't been total assholes. Looking for my husband, Nazim? Check the Jarl's backside. That's what? where he stuffs himself these days. Your husband stuffs yourself in the Jarl's backside. Take from that what you will, folks. Oh hey, look at that, it's your Vasker. That uh, must be the meat hall to the companions. 
I'm gonna check that out in a separate series of videos. I am, um, because I'm assuming they're gonna have a long like Fighters Guild quest line. Yeah, let's talk to this crazy guy. But yeah, I'm gonna have that as a separate series of videos. So-called emperor is a coward. That's right. I said coward. Oh, That's yes. his opinion, not mine. He agreed to banish the worship of Talos at the tip of an Aldmeri sword. They called it the White Gold Concordat. Well, I call it blasphemy. A true son of the Empire would never have turned his back on our greatest hero. Not at any price. Well, let me tell you something, friend. Cyrodiil is a long way from here, and in Skyrim, we will never forsake mighty Talos. Alright, let's see what uh, we know about let Talos. Them come. I have no fear, for Talos is my ally, and I am his prophet. His word is upon my lips, his voice in my throat. Yeah, he's a crazy prophet. I already know Hello, a good bit about friend. Talos, but let's see what he has to if say. If you seek knowledge about mighty Talos, you have most certainly come to the right person. In mortal life, Talos was a Nord, possessed of unmatched tactical skill, limitless wisdom, and the power to see into men's hearts. Talos mastered the power of the voice. The and voice. With it, he united the lands of men into a great empire. In southern lands, he was known by the name Tiber Septim. Here in Skyrim, we honor him by his proper Nord name. So great was his reign in life. When he ascended to the heavens, he was made Lord of the Divines. If you want to know more, I'm sure you can find any number of tomes on the subject. No, I think you covered just about everything. That's pretty much all there is to it. That's all she wrote. All right, let's head on up to the uh, to the Yarrow then. Wait a minute. One thing first. Oh, come on! You know me by now. I hate walking downstairs, and I love jumping into pools. The thinking pool. Ah, damn it! I'm stuck. This is what I get for acting like a big child. Alright, easy does it, easy does it, and over, there we go, alright, let's go talk to El Yarlo, did you see my cannonball, did you see him, oh yeah, yeah this is a pretty nice looking meat hall, hey there, how you doing, that is, need a blade, you should talk to Adrian at the forge, he kind of sounds like Alan Schwarzenegger. If my cleaning gets in your way, just say the word and I'll be off. No, no, that's okay. I don't mind. Ain't nobody high and mighty in these halls, except in the yard. And me. This is a very nice looking hall. I don't like how she's skulking towards me with a sword, though. What's the meaning of this interruption? Jarl Balgrup is not receiving visitors. But I'm a sexy visitor. That makes it okay. I'm gonna go with news of the dragon Helgen and all that. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then, the Jarl will want to speak to you personally. I like to think so too. Hello, Jarlo. So, you were at Helgen. You saw this dragon with your own eyes? <laughs> Had a good view from the chopping block. Nice. Alright, let's see now. Take a look at our options. Da -da -da. I think I'm gonna go with. Uh, I like Ulfric. I'm gonna go mention Ulfric. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that dragon is lurking in the mountains, that is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while a dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, 
I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Someone's whipped. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. Ah, oh, you over encumbered me, you bastard. That is another Can't thing you can do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents. He's coming on him. Perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Now right, I'm gonna have to ditch some gear because yeah, his generosity is just wearing me down. All right, so he gave me some steel armor. Oh shit, that's nice armor. I'm gonna equip that right now. Of course, if I'd have known I would have got this, I would never have bothered making the uh, making the uh, the bond banded iron armor a minute ago. I invested money into that armor. I don't want to sell it. I'm gonna sell it. I don't want to drop it. I'm gonna drop. Uh, I think I'm gonna drop an imperial sword. There we go. Ah, that'll do it. Lead the way, Yarly. You shouldn't leave weapons laying around. Someone could get hurt. If I see you doing it again, that someone will be you. Have I made myself clear? Jeez, sorry. See that it doesn't happen again. I now feel about an inch tall. <laughs> I just got in trouble. Faringar. I think I found someone who can help you with your dragon project. Go ahead and fill him in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. That's my specialty. That's, that's what I do best. Uh, let's see, we got some good options there. I'll go the Straight to the one. point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I, uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone, said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. I'm it's pretty sure I have that already. <laughs> yeah, you mean this one right here that I have? Ah, the dragon stone of Bleak Falls Barrow. You already found it. You are cut from a different cloth than the usual brutes the Jarl foists on me. Yeah, I am pretty awesome. You'll have to see the Jarl about that. Maybe his steward, Avenici. I'm sure one of them will pay you appropriately. No, oh, you you give me you give me some money. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the Ongo. Ah, student of the craft. You'll need to start by learning an enchantment. Take an enchanted weapon or piece of armor, then use the arcane enchanter to learn its secrets. The item is destroyed in the process, so be wary. Once you know an enchantment, you'll need a filled soul gem and something to enchant. You'll use the arcane enchanter for that, too. Of course, I have everything you need for sale if you have the coin. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that for now. I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia will provide some form of recompense. He sounds like an Good. emotional man. You're clearly better suited than I am to carry out such a menial task. Oh, I hate this guy's arrogance. A prospective student, are you? Well, I'm afraid I'm not much good at teaching. You should try your luck at the College of Winterhold. Maybe I will. Maybe I will do just that. If I said that was a tedious question, would you be smart enough to know what I meant? Probably not. As long as I'm left alone to pursue my research, I don't care who gives the orders. Now, I'm a busy man, and your pointless questions are boring me terribly. Good day. I fully intend on killing this guy at some point. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the... 
I wonder what Iraleth is so excited about. You should come too. Huh? A dragon. How exciting. Where was it seen? What was it doing? What? I'd take this a bit more seriously if I were you. If a dragon decides to attack Whiterun, I don't know if we can stop it. Yeah, I'm pretty confident Let's I go. can. All right, up we go. That guy's still watching me to see if I drop anything on the floor. So, Irileth tells me you came from the Western Watchtower? Yes, my lord. Tell him what you told me about the dragon. Oh, that's right. So it coming from the south. It was fast. Faster than anything I've ever seen. What did it do? Is it attacking the Watchtower? No, my lord. It was just circling overhead when I left. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought it would have come after me, for sure. Good work, son. We'll take it from here. Head down to the barracks for some food and rest. You've earned it. Irleth, you'd better Hell with that. Go get that dragon. Down there. I've already ordered my men to muster near the main gate. Good. Don't fail me. There's no time to stand on ceremony, my friend. I need your help again. I want you to go with Irileth and help her fight this dragon. You survived Helgen, so you have more experience with dragons than anyone else here. But I haven't forgotten the service you did for me in retrieving the dragon stone for Faringar. As a token of my esteem, I have instructed Avenici that you are now permitted to purchase property Booyah. in the city. And please, accept this gift from my personal armory. Gonna put the first step on the- Ah, oh, you just overcomered me again! I very much like to see this dragon. No, I can't afford to risk both of you. I need you here working on ways to defend the city against these dragons. As you command. One last thing, Irileth. This isn't a death or glory mission. I need to know what we're dealing with. Don't worry, my lord. I'm the very soul of course. I like her. She's got spunk. Alright, look, I get the Yarl is a nice guy who likes to, to reward you know, people justly for what they do, but still, come on, you're killing me here, buddy. I really need to stash my gear somewhere. So. Yeah. Think. Uh. Damn it, Yarl, why do you have to do this to me? I think I'm gonna have to part with. Oh, I can't really get rid of Balgruff's greatsword. I don't want to get rid of any of my ancient Nord weapons either. 